Hey there, fish heads. Jen Cravasi here, Jekyll Bates. It is Tuesday, November 26th. You guys are getting an update on real time today. I'm going to try and get this uploaded by this evening. I've got some orders to spray. Today, I'm featuring this four piece larger bait order. You've seen that in a spray session. These three you did not, but I have uh, I've shown some pictures of the mouse. And this is one of those uh, crazy crawler flapper type deals that has the two wings on the side. Bigger baits, I love doing bigger baits. These are going out to Theodore Shane McClanahan who has graciously and patiently been waiting on these for a while. But he's always like, he's given me several orders. Every time he does, he's like, really, I'm not gonna be fishing these till spring. So whenever you can get to them, get to them. And we talk about the baits, we talk about variations on what we're gonna get done. But um, these are getting finished and getting out the door today. And uh, we're going to continue right on through the week with a couple more spray sessions I've got lined up for you guys and also um, a couple more updates and tips and tricks I've, I want to put together. It is the holiday week. We're Thanksgiving already. Holy crap, it's Thanksgiving already. This year has flown by. I wish each and every one of you guys out there a fantastic holiday weekend. Stay warm. Stay out of the roads if you can. Stay off of them. Um, I know a lot of people travel on Thanksgiving to go home and see their families. So there's some bad weather coming our way, so be mindful of that. Just be very careful if you're out there this week and you're in one of the states that, uh, and actually I think there's a lot of states that are going to be affected by bad weather. So please take care. Please come back. I want to see all your happy smiling faces after Thanksgiving. This is probably going to be, I might sneak one more in, depends on how many orders I can get through. I've got a couple of Jackal Rearrange 110s for Donald David that I want to get done today and I've got a couple more things that I might be able to throw into a spray session. We'll see how it goes. Uh, I've got about 16 orders outstanding to try and knock out by this weekend. So anyways, back into this. So there's a four piece order here. You guys saw a spray session of that. I'm not going to beat the dead horse. You guys have seen a promo for the holidays. You guys have seen the full spray session. This is the Livingston Bee Viper 8. It's a killer pattern. A lot of fun doing that. Um, he Shane is one of those clients that is a repeat client. He always says, be creative, do what you do. He only had a couple of requests on these. He wanted this one and a trout. So he wanted the trout. And then he wanted the mouse. So we'll talk about those in just a second. Um, let's start with this guy. This is a double flapper. Uh, it's got the imprinting on it on the Buescher tail. I hope I'm not destroying that, that uh, the nomenclature there on how to pronounce that. But it is a patented Raider. It's a TCP Raider double flap. Um, in a very cool frog pattern, a uh, little bloody I did on the uh, undersides, and of course these were all sprayed while the while the bait was together. So that is the belly of the bait with both flappers down, and then as you work around the bait, you can see that there's some really cool gold and red on there, almost Lannister colors, folks. You know I'm still a Game of Thrones freak. Um, but no, this is just lots of fun doing this bait. It's a larger bait. I hope that he's able to slay some musky or, uh, or some pike or something fun. This has got three coats on it. And the eyes are also really cool. These are just, they're standard Amazon eyes, folks. Um, if you're looking for something a little bit bigger in a pinch, you know, there's lots of resources out there. Some of them can get them to you faster than others. I know uh, John over at Jetson always got a huge waiting list. Dead Meat Customs always got a huge waiting list, but they're really awesome, awesome eyes. If you need them fast, if you if you need them in a pinch, check on Amazon. These are Brule eyes, and I've got a link in the description below um, for all of those eyes. So take a look at those. There's like five or six maybe even more than that maybe up to a dozen resources that I link you guys every single video for eyes because um, there's I don't keep any industry trade secrets um, if you guys need help now with that said I do want you to be you know a little bit more um, self-sufficient if you guys 
can find them on your own. I certainly don't uh, discourage that either. But this is just a really cool frog pattern. Lots of fun doing that. So that's number one. Number two. And you guys have already seen that, so we're just going to touch on the other three. This is was going to be a full gray mouse, but I really I like these brown mice as well. It always makes me think of Pete over at Reckless Rodents. Man, we're wishing you well too, brother. I need I need for you to get back and start doing your mice. You got to do your mice and your rats um, because the community misses you. So yeah, if you guys know Pete or, or you know anything about him, he's one of the best builders in, in the game. And uh, he had some major surgery. So he is out of the game through the holidays, which really sucks. I can't even imagine what he's going through. So I feel you, brother. Get back in it soon. Uh, so we can see some more of your beautiful baits. But in the meantime, y'all can check out this one. I had a lot of fun doing this one. It is a little gray on the bottom, gray and white. That double piece. And, of course, this has just come off the clear coat rack. So it still needs to get uh, dressed and re-geared. I've got, this is what the flappers are for. I've got all the hardware to do that. These are fairly easy to take off. Um, and each, each one is independent but these will go right back on. And then last but certainly not least, we have this natural trout. He asked, this is a headbanger. It's a headbanger with a tail. I'm gonna show you the tail in just a second. It's got a good rattle on it. These things are patent pending. I got, I, I get lots of questions on where, where do I get the blanks? These are not blanks. Everything that you see here and mostly what I prefer to do in my orders uh, are repaints of, of brand name baits. Um, I, I don't subscribe to a lot of the knockoffs that are out there, but some of them are good and some of them ha are not uh, intellectual, intellectual property violations. Some are, some are not. So you really just have to be careful on uh, what you're getting. And then a lot of the times they use inferior plastic. So just be careful on what you're getting. Uh, if you have any questions, reach out to the people that are selling baits. They're usually pretty pretty uh, good to talk to you guys about stuff like that. Reach out to Dinger, reach out to Cedar Run. Um, there's just a lot of resources out there that are selling the good stuff. And then there's people that just that don't. So uh, you guys can always get my recommendations offline. I don't bash anybody, small business or otherwise. So there is your trout. Fun. Rainbow trout. And then you can see that that is the genuine headbanger. Let me show you the tail real quick on this as well. Let's see, what have I done with that little guy? The tails are neat on this because there is a treble that hangs down off the tail. It's a curved, uh, almost like a swivel, but it's uh, just a curved two, time, or two, uh, two eyelet deal here with the split ring, and that's just going to go back on the bottom of the bait and then uh, just some other hardware I need to reapply this is gonna get out the door today that's what I've got for you guys today happy Thanksgiving um, on the lookout you guys need to be on the lookout for the fish miss giveaway that I do every year haven't quite figured out what I'm gonna be giving away but it's gonna be something really cool might be a perch pattern Johnston lore might be a toothache Johnston lore I was they were gracious to send me for my winning um, their contest this year I got a bunch of blanks from them and uh, I think that might be what I'm doing this year but anyways I haven't 100% figured out what I'm gonna give away we have gone over 500 videos we are just about to hit 6,000 subscribers uh, really again from the bottom of my heart thank you guys so 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 much for supporting the channel and contributing it's how I'm able to give back to you guys so anything that you can do, even if you just want to send me a note and say hello, it makes me smile. You guys have a great day. Happy Thanksgiving. We'll talk to you somewhere around Black Friday. I'm fairly certain. See ya. Happy casting.